Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Cat and Beats. I just want to do a quick video on a plugin called Golfos. Uh, I just bought it and I really like it and it's one of those little plugins that does the job and it does the job very well so it really just works. And I kind of want to share this with you guys because I know that I have quite a nice nerd following so let's get ready and get our nerd on together and then you guys can see this thing. So um, this is Golfos. I have a project here called Lose the Child. It's a better not. That's the song and it's the remake of that. I'm just going to turn it on and off and then we're going to take Golfos after this and put it on a project file that I mixed and mastered for Dara. So let's first um, have a listen to this track like this and I'll click on bypass a few times so you can hear what it sounds like. And now it's engaged. So what this thing is doing for me is just opening up and making it nice and sexy. Now I'm going to open up uh, Dara's file and then I'm going to explain to you what is actually going on, at least to my ability. All right, so I have the Dara project file here right now. And um, if you're a Patreon supporter, remember you can download this file. If you're not a Patreon supporter just yet, if you want to support the channel, please go over to Patreon and you can download this file as well and follow along. Anyway, this project sounds like this. And before I did all the mixing, it sounded like this. After. Now let's take it to a new stage, okay? Because this, this stage is fun and, and dandy and everything, but... Um, when I'm listening to it, when I'm coming back from vacation, it has a little bit of a her in there. So the her, in my opinion, is somewhere over here. Somewhere her, it's somewhere there. It's somewhere in the boxy area. But I don't know exactly where it is. I've already tried to get rid of it with Ozone 8, but I couldn't do it. So let's see if Golfus can do it. And let me show you how it works. Um, and I'm pretty sure it can because I'm in love with this plugin. So, Golfus. Boop. That's what it looks like. Um, there's a couple of buttons up here. Recover, Tame, Bias, Brighten, and Boost. Uh, then there's a button over here and a button over there. Uh, let me show you uh, what it does. So with Recover, it's... Where did it go? With Recover... Come on, you bitch. There you go. With Recover, what it will do is it will recover frequencies that are being dominated so this is a smart plugin so if your song looks or sounds like this according to what this plugin hears it will recover the other frequencies so that it will sound um, as good as possible it will cut this a little bit it will cut that a little bit and it will recover the frequencies that aren't there all right if, for instance, you will go to tame, what tame will do is it will tame the frequencies that are being dominant. So it tames that. So you either recover non-dominant frequencies, like this one, or it tames the frequencies that are being dominant. Basically, cut or boost. Now, then you have a bias button in which you can say, I want you to listen more to the... Uh, tame, so that you're taming the track, so that you're cutting the track, or I want you to listen more to the recovering of the track now uh, brighton is a very simple button it just gives a little bit more top end and for techno we definitely want bright things and boost is a really cool little thing as well what that does is it increases the low end and or it goes negative as well gives a boost to the top end all right a um, couple little buttons as well you can alt click and then you have a control z function and you can shift and drag which you will go uh, slow uh, on top of that, you can use your keyboard and do keyboard functions like this. All right. All right. So that's all nice and dandy. Let's get started and start working. So the only way this plugin is going to work is if you first put in the recover mode or the tame mode. Otherwise, there's going to be absolutely no reaction. So let's have a listen and a play. Let's recover. So this is how much is recovering. It's already sounded pretty interesting. Let's tame it. 
So you can hear that obviously the low end is very dominant. And it's cutting all that stuff out. So let's just uh, put in a little bit of recovery, a little bit of tame according to listening to it. And then I'll tell you why I did it. Done. Okay, so for me, that's already like that. You see how fast that went. I'm just going to click on bypass and I'll tell you why I did these things. Perfect. Done. So the recover part, it just brings out. A little bit of the frequency that I'm not having yet so a little bit of the top end because before it sounded like a blanket was put on the song and I kind of needed to uncover that blanket it sounds a bit weird but imagine if you put a blanket on your speaker then it kind of sounds weird or you put your head underneath a blanket it's just kind of that kind of sound the tame I don't like using it too much because it will tame too much of my low end so I tend to just kind of push into that and get the low end balance just right. With the bias, I can again get the low end balance just right. So if I go down, I get more recover, so more low end. And the brighten is just to <laughs> go against the uh, the bias again. I just kind of want a little bit brighter because it's techno. And then the boost was used just to give a little bit more low end. Now we can also use this according to how we uh, think that the low end needs to sound. So for instance, if you have a track and you have a problem frequency area. So let's just say that the, the problem frequency is only going to be between 200 and 5 hertz and, uh, I don't know, 4 or 600 hertz. Say, for instance, you have the track there and you really narrow down that that's where it's a bit shit. Put on Golf Us, recover your problem area, and then see how it sounds. So, for instance, if you have a drum group and you're just like, ugh, there's this honky ugh in it. You can tell Golf Us to just work here and it will leave the rest alone. Fucking genius. Anyway, let's have a little listen because I want to be sure everything sounds good. Yeah, that's, that's good. So I just moved it away a little bit because it was cutting a little bit too of my bass. So I want that low, low, low thuddy bass as well to come out. So um, this thing just works. I mean, listen to the difference. So if you want to plug in the show up to work and actually do its job, Golf Us is your go-to. Uh, Unfortunately, it's 159 euros, but for me, that is money well spent. Wait for a Black Friday or a, um, or a or, you know, Christmas or something. Maybe they'll have a sale for you. And on top of all of that, I'll see you guys next week where we're going to be mixing and mastering totally in the box using Sound Toys and Good Hertz and Golf Us because this is my new baby, my new girlfriend. Um, so yeah, Golf Us, you're awesome. Dudes and dudettes, uh, this is a magic little plugin to just do the last percent. See you guys next week, Thursday. Bye-bye.